Hi Virgo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Virgo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Virgo. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Three of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is an energy of collaboration and cooperation, working on something with someone, building something solid with a good foundation, something that can last a long time. It looks like you and someone are on the same page. You share the same goal and the same interest here. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. We have the Empress, Venus Energy, the Five of Pentacles in the reverse, earth energy and the seven of pentacles earth energy there is an energy here of really putting in time effort and patience when it comes to this um it looks like you and someone could have at some point separated and there's an opportunity to come back together and repair this connection um with the empress we're seeing a person who's very invested in this connection and the long-term future of it this is someone who does value you and wants you in their life forever um this person is willing to wait they're willing to no matter how long it takes this is someone who is already quite invested and they do want to see this through okay so um let's clarify these cards virgo Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Nine of Cups, and this is Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio Energy. So this is an energy of wish fulfillment. This is emotional fulfillment. This person views you as their, their dream person, like you're their wish come true. So let's see, we have the Nine of Wands, Fire Energy, the Chariot, Cancer Energy, and the High Priestess, Pisces Energy. They're very drawn towards you, very attracted to you, desiring you very strongly. This is someone who is willing to do whatever it takes to be with you. They're willing to overcome obstacles, move mountains. This is someone who really believes in the connection that they share with you. They feel like this is something that's meant to be. And it, just because it's meant to be doesn't mean it doesn't require effort. Like they're willing to do whatever it takes for this connection. They feel very motivated to make things work with you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Virgo. Okay, we have a fiery climax approaches, full moon in Aries. Okay, we have getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Okay, so let's see.
Arcadia Rebirth and New Beginnings. New beginnings are often disguised as painful endings. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Virgo. Okay, we have surrender your ego, cultivate gratitude, be of service to others and come from your heart. A big ego can work against you, but humility will further your goals. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Virgo. I hope you have a really, really good day, Virgo. Bye, Virgo.